saving a document. From the earliest days of personal computing, the watchword has been save early, save often. There's nothing more frustrating than working half the day and losing your document because your power goes out. So, here are some tips to protect your work from disasters data loss. Name and save your document shortly after you first create it. You'll see the steps to save in this session. Have a habit of doing a quick save with Control and S. If you're leaving your computer for an extended period of time, save and close your document. Now let us see how to save a document in Word 2007. Go to Office button. In that, click on Save button, which displays a Save dialog box. In that, type your document name and select your saving location and then click Save. Word does the rest. All you need to do is remember where you have saved your work. Or you can directly use the keyboard shortcut Control and S to save your document. Save as option. To save a previously saved file in a new location or with a new name, you have to use this Save As option. The shortcut key for Save As option is F12. The Save As option lets you save your file with a new name when you use this command. The new Save As option in Word provides five mode of saving options. They are Word Document. Use to save the document in the default file format of Word 2007.docx format. Word Template. Use to save the document as a template that can be used to format future documents. Word 97 2003 document. You can save a copy of a document that is fully compatible with Word 97 2003. But Word can save files in over a dozen different formats. If you're sharing the file with someone who's using an older version of Word, then choose Word 97 2003 to save the document in .doc format. You have to decide yourself in which format you are going to save your file. Find add-ins for other file formats. Learn about add-ins to save to other formats such as PDF or XPS. Other formats. Use to open the Save As dialog box to select from all possible file types. In this selection list, you can select any mode of saving options which suits your requirement. Closing a document. After saving your document, the next process you will be doing is closing your document. For that, go to the Office button. In that, click on Close button. This will close your Word document. When you close a document, Word checks to see if you've made any changes to the file. When you've made changes, Word always asks whether you'd like to save the document. If you want to save it, click Yes. Otherwise, click No.